This is a test to see which of four types of paper holds up best to heat for displacer construction. My paper samples include 100% cotton, a heavier mat, some basic printer paper, and some yellow paper. Here's my copper top engine. It has at least 100 hours of runtime on it at temperatures up to 700 degrees Fahrenheit. You can see the displacer has some discoloration on the bottom. When I tried to look up how much heat paper could take, I found answers for autoignition or spontaneous combustion ranging from 400 to almost 900 degrees Fahrenheit. If 400 was true, all my displacers would have disintegrated by now, although not by outright combustion due to limited oxygen in the displacer cylinder. All my Stirling engines use paper for displacers, mainly because on the first one I needed a quick way to test the displacer size, and I used paper to make it, and it held up fine with only minor discoloring on the bottom. Between 450 and 500 degrees Fahrenheit, we see the basic printer paper has darkened a lot. The yellow paper is starting to brown. By 550, the basic printer paper is blackened. The yellow paper is not far behind. The matte paper is starting to have a lot of browning and slight browning on the cotton paper. Between 600 and 650, the printer and yellow paper are black where they touch the pan. The mat is dark brown and the cotton paper is medium brown. This would be as hot as my hot plate goes. Alright, here we have the printer paper, virtually uh, completely blackened, but uh, actually still holding up fairly well. well a little brittle. This is the yellow paper that I've used in a lot of my displacers. After operating, I bring it up to 650 degrees. It's much less brittle than the printer paper, the standard printer paper. Here's the matte paper. Uh, as you can see, they were all quite a bit darker on the side facing the pan. For our durability. Yeah. A little brittle. Better than the printer paper. Still would hold up well as a displacer because it's never going to have those forces on it. This is the cotton. Once again darker on the side that was down. Once again darker on the side that was down. Doing the same test as I did with the other ones that cracked. This one holds up much better. more to wreck it. So 